Oh, oh. Who's that? What's going on? I don't think anyone else is on the island. Who are you? Did did Murdoch gas you? Are you going to be on the album? He keeps knocking people out, then bringing them here to play. That whale. That big fish. The thing is eyeing me up. It wants to eat me blood. Whales! They're enormous, too big. Too big is, is, is horror. Huh? Really? Oh, thank God it's gone. <gasps> it's still there, look, he's it. You trying to get me killed? Go away, go on. Sod off. Sod off. What are you doing here anyway? He's gone. I thank you so much. I hate Wales. Thanks a lot. Who, who are you then? Do you want to come and watch a zombie film? I've just got a Blu-ray of Evil Dead. Um, or maybe Dracula. Or have you seen The Brood? That's great. Or let the right one in. Well, no. Unless they've got a whale in them, I can't stand whales. Take a wild guess. It's that swine, Murdoch. He knows I hate whales. So he stuck me down there and paid that whale to watch me. I don't know how he paid a whale, though, but he did. Now, if I try and leg it, that whale appears. It's also Murdoch can make sure I do the vocals on a new piece of egomania. He sings like someone treading on a duck. My vocals is way better blood! So he just makes me sing. I hate that sod. Last album, he stole my liver. Well, I didn't wake up here exactly. I just kind of came round. Murdoch kindly had me gassed and kidnapped me and I woke up here in the underwater room on this island. Then he made me do the vocals on his new demos. I borrowed a load of films of Murdoch. He's a member of this film delivery service, Glove Film. They send their stalker over the island and drop the films on the beach. It's great, it's wicked. I got sent Boning John Malkovich. Tits a Wonderful Life. And Chitty Chitty Bang 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 as Chipple Bill. A bit random, but very, very, very watchable. <laughs> He's trapped, is he? Hmm. Brilliant. He deserves it. The taste of his own crooked medicine. The power's probably gone again in the engine room. <laughs> Just speak to Dave. He should be able to sort it. Who's Dave? Where are you, a copper? Work it out, blood. Do you want me just to play this game for you? He's the engineer in the boiler room. He's fixing the heating or something. To be honest, I don't think he's much good. He just doesn't seem to have the tools. He's very unequipped. I'd leave him right if I was you, because he's a rotter. He'd probably end up trapping you somewhere, or he'll get you to piece together the bits of his book. That thing's got a life of its own. I tell you what. If you can figure out a way to get this well off my back permanently, I'll be grateful. He's scaring the pants off of me. <laughs> <laughs>